Welcome back to another episode. It's Ken from Keras Investments Inc., where we make investments simple. Okay, so we're breaking down Tesla right now. As we can see on the screen, the, the uh, stock is trading just over $842 per share. Um, the day today is January 20. We understand that the EV market is trading lower for the day. Uh, we can see likes of XPANG. Um, it did went up for 8%, but now it retract back and it's down 3%. We could see same for NEO as well as 80% uh, of the EV stocks. Everyone is down today except Tesla is holding its ground. For the last five days, we um, can also see that Tesla is actually trading very nicely. Um, it's not dipping too far. So we will be looking at Tesla. Uh, we saw that the price of the stock is slowly um, is slowly staying around the 835 to 850 mark. Um, I, I, we did sign a few weeks that it went up to as high as an 880. And then the price slowly came back down to where it is right now. Now, um, some of the analysts right now, they are uh, predicting that Tesla will uh, go to at least uh, like $1,000 per share. I personally think Tesla will go to... Um, uh, from anywhere from a thousand uh four hundred to two thousand dollars per share um i know that's a big uh, like stretch in between but from where it's coming from now for any of you guys that know my backstory i have been in tesla uh, originally when the stock dropped um in 2018 uh, like 2019 2018 around that time uh, and my average is less than 195 dollars per share now that's before the split so right now if we um if we do the actual price of my share is around thirty nine dollars per share. So I'm in Tesla for a very very long time. Um, I'm hoping uh, my dream is to see if this thing could go to two thousand dollars per share. Um, originally that was my dream to get it to two thousand dollars per share, but then we saw that it gets to more than that. And then with the split, I think it's going to hit around the same price um, very very soon, uh, more sooner than later. So for anyone that's trading. Uh, with Tesla, I highly recommend that you keep an eye on the stock because the price will be going up in the next uh, weeks, if not months to come. Now, there are more competition that's, um, um, I would say there are more uh, stiff competition that's coming out, especially from um, our main manufacturers that we're used to seeing in our local uh, neighborhoods. Um, the likes of BMW, the likes of Mercedes, and the likes of uh, Volkswagen and those other companies. Now, we did get report that Mercedes-Benz um, is unveiling um, their new SUV um, to compete with Tesla. I will go ahead and give you a look of that SUV. Uh, yes, guys, so this is what the car looks like. I'm sure there's more models to come. So there will be more changes as it goes. Um, but what we're seeing is that Mercedes is trying to compete in the market. They saw that more and more consumers are looking to go electric. So this is um, a view of one of the model um, that will be competing with uh, the Tesla. Now, also, we understand that Audi as well is in the same boat and BMWs. So uh, the competition will be very stiff for Tesla going forward. But with the, uh, the tech and the advancement and the dream, and the Tesla lovers, of course, um, the stock price will only get higher. Now, it's a different story once Apple comes out, because then I believe Apple have a huge following, such as myself as well. And I guarantee you that 50% of the people that owns an Apple uh, like product, whether it's a phone, a watch, or a computer, um, I think that 50% of those people, when they're deciding to choose a car or um, electric vehicle, those people will move towards the Apple platform for sure. Now, uh, for sure, when it comes to uh, like tech, uh, we believe in Tesla, but at the same time, we understand that when Apple comes out, the, the hardcore Apple people will migrate over to Apple. Now, if we look back on the stock right now, guys, it's still trading very good for the last 30 days. If we look back in December, the stock was actually um, trading in the low $600 per share. Um, I was tempted to sell uh, when it hits on um, the first 800, but I hold on and um, it went to 880. Um, I sell a little bit off the top and then I got back in just around 810. That was a few days ago, actually. 
I know it's it. That was uh, a few days ago when it drops in the low. I got back in just around 810. You can see my markers set up here. So if you guys are holding Tesla, I, again, I just want to keep the video simple. If you want to do more research, you can definitely go um, to do uh, these research. But I'm holding long term. And for anyone that's holding as well, um, I hope you guys get to hold um, as long as you can and to get to that price range. I'm out. But guys, I want to keep this short and sweet. That's why it's important to watch the video until the end because I normally throw some stuff in. But guys, your family, if I succeed, I want to make sure you succeed as well. So if you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment, and please go ahead to subscribe because we're doing this all together. Guys, until next time, peace out.